There's nothing wrong with you. What the fuck is that? Uh, people driving by outside my window. <sighs> oh, here we go. Whoop. Whoa, whoa. Alright. Are we here already? Oh, yep, we're here. Let's go get some. Well, well, well. Welcome to my land. Living is playing something up. According to the control panel light up there, the entire building is going to self destruct in about six minutes. I'm pretty sure it's a problem with the light. I think the light's on the thing, but just in case it isn't, I am actually going to have to kill you um, as discussed earlier. So let's call that three minutes and then a minute break, where we should leave allegedly two minutes to figure out how to shut down whatever is starting all the fires. So anyway, that's the itinerary. Also, I took the liberty of watching the tapes of you killing her, and I'm not going to make the same mistakes. Four so? part plan is this. One, no portal services. Two, start the neurotoxin immediately. Three, bomb-proof shields for me. Leading directly onto number four, four, I'm throwing it you. You know what? This plan is so good, I'm going to give you a sporting chance and turn off the neurotoxin. I'm joking. Of course, good luck. Neurotoxin level at oh. in five. Ah, what? Where are you going? Don't run, don't run. I tell you why you should run. The harder you breathe, the more neurotoxin you're in your head. Yeah, well, you're dumb. Good job, you dip. That's sounded real. Go. That was actually an impression of you. Because you just fell into my trap. My brilliant trap. Really? Whoa. Shut up. Where's the core? There it is. No, 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 no. Whoa. Close up there? Okay. Huh. No, okay. Why is it? There we go. Core corruption at 50%. Vent system compromised. Neurotoxin offline. Reactor explosion in four minutes. What happened? You got stuck. Whoa. Ah. Where? What's the situation? Oh. Hey, hey, lady. Hey, Ricky. Are you out having yourself a little adventure? Yes. What, are you fighting that guy? You got that under control? You know, because there's a lot of stuff on the fire. Hey, count the clock. Man, that is trouble. Situation's looking. There we go. Core corruption at 75%. Reactor explosion timer destroyed. Reactor explosion oh. uncertainty. Emergency preemption protocol initiated. Oh. Uh oh. The will self destruct in two minutes. Enough! I told you not to put these cores on, but you don't listen to me. Quiet. How do I get to him? A sign of worse guy. All I wanted to do was make everything better for me. All you had to do was to solve a couple of hundred simple tests for a few years. Come on, man. How do I hit you? Well, we could go to space. Oh, no. Oh, here we go. Oh, wait. Never mind. I was lying. How do I hit him? Oh wait. 
Ah! Where is it up there? I think it's up there somewhere. There it is. Okay. Now how do I get that? How do I get that? Oh. It's good that you know that. Oh, look at that. Sup, bro? Whoa. Yeah, apparently. Warning. Oh. Core corruption at 100%. Manual core replacement required. Oh, I see. <laughs> Substitute core. Are you ready to start? Corrupted core. Are you ready to start? What do you think? Interpreting vague answer as oh. yes. No, 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 no. Did you pick up on my sarcasm? Stalemate detected. Uh oh. Fire detected in the stalemate resolution annex. Extinguishing. Why is everything on fire? When did that happen? Oh, that just cleans right off, does it? Well, that would have been good to know a little earlier. Stalemate resolution associate, please press the stalemate resolution button. Do not press that button. Do not press the button. No, There's explosions, explosives behind him. I forbid you to press it. Don't press that button. Don't press it. Come back. There's explosives behind him. No. Part five. Oh. Is that right, Wheatley? Guess what? I'm breaking the world! Ah! Space! Space? Whoa! Let go! We're in space! Space! Ah, let go! Let go! I'm still connected! <laughs> I can pull myself in! I can still fix this! I already fixed it. And you are not coming back. Oh no! Change your plans! Hold on to me! Tighter! Oh! Hey look, it's GLaDOS's old body. Old head. Hey, look, it's the co-op buddies. Oh, thank God, you're all right. You know, being Carolyn taught me a valuable lesson. I thought you were my greatest enemy, when all along you were my best friend. The surge of emotion that shot through me when I saved your life taught me an even more valuable lesson. Where Carolyn lives in my brain. Carolyn, delete. Goodbye, Carolyn. You know... Deleting Carolyn just now taught me a valuable lesson. The best solution to a problem is usually the easiest one. And I'll be honest, killing you is hard. You know what my days used to be like? I just tested. Nobody murdered me, or put me in a potato, or fed me to birds. I had a pretty good life. And then you showed up, you dangerous, mute, lunatic. So you know what? You win. Just go. <laughs> it's been fun. Don't come back. Huh. I really didn't realize we were that close to the game, or the end of the game. That's cool, I beat Portal 2 in one sitting. Fantastic. Oh wait. Here we go.
Aww. GLaDOS gave us the original companion cube. Oh shit! Ah. I love this song. If I didn't talk over it though, I might get hit with a copyright strike. But oh uh, yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed Portal 2. She was a lot like you. Maybe not quite as heavy. Now little Carolyn is in you too. One day they woke me up. So I could live forever. It's such a shame the same will never happen to you. You got your short sad life left. That's what I'm counting. Goodbye, my only friend. Oh, did you think I meant you? That would be funny if it weren't so sad. Well, you have been replaced. I don't need anyone now. When I delete you, maybe I'll stop feeling so bad. Oh. I love this game. So fantastic. And that was Portal 2. Thank you all for watching. I will see you all in the next Let's Play. I wish I could take it all back. I honestly do. I honestly do wish I could take it all back. And not just because I'm stranded in space. You're in space. I know you are, mate. Yeah, we're both in space. Anyway, you know, if I was ever to see her again, do you know what I'd say? I'm in space. I'd say, I'm sorry. Sincerely. I am sorry I was bossy and monstrous. And. I am genuinely sorry. In space. The end. <laughs>